I'm glad to oh. see you got wood. That's a little bit of a crap shoot. So wait one sec, you're, you're an interior designer now? What the hell? That's not cool. So here we are. Welcome to my theater. Nice. It's going to be a beautiful space. It's going to be sick. Hey, look at I've got my uh, good good pal here, Rob from Ridgeline. He's going to be doing the demolition in the theater today and getting us ready. And uh, his company's also going to be doing the carpentry work in here. So this is Rob's first time in the room, and I'm time to bring him up to speed. So it looks like it's going to be a nice little project, Clinton. We're going to uh, make it look beautiful for you. Um, with the new design you got from Shiva. So let me take you on a tour through our space here. The theme is like an old Montreal theme. Okay. But it's going to be a little bit contemporary, right? Yeah. So, and old Montreal is kind of going through this whole renovation period right yeah. now, right? Like the there's old a lot of old stone and the reclaimed bricks yeah. and things like that. But there's like a lot of steel and windows and glass and things going yep. on and reclaimed woods and barn beams and all this kind of stuff. You know, yep. old lofty spaces, things like that. So we're going to try and capture a bit of that feel. It's a good character wall. We can yeah. definitely work with that. That yeah. space. Yeah, for sure. No, I love that. Uh, I love that wall. It's one of the reasons that I bought the house. Yeah. So, so we're we'll going to rip all this wainscot out. We're going to be, uh, well, this, the painter will be taking this stuff down. Some wallpaper. And we're going to, yeah, we're going to yank out this wall unit. So basically everything that's oak in here is going to be, gone. going to be going. Perfect. Yeah. There's a no oak policy in here. And we're going to do the three chairs right here. Okay. Okay. Three chairs. Then that'll be up on the, on the elevated platform. Yep. Then there's going to be three more chairs. Down below. At floor level. Correct. Right. And then what we're going to do is have a 100 inch screen up here. Yeah. So 100 inch will be the diagonal. And we've already done the math, basically. So three, three screen heights is roughly where our front row of seats is. Right. We've, we're going to have a sight line analysis coming together. Okay. Which basically is a little AutoCAD trick where we take the projector and the screen height and the seating heights and put an average height human in there and we figure out. Are we looking at the screen or the back of someone's head? Yeah. We're gonna, that'll help so us figure out the, the height of the stage. Perfect. So we'll have all those details. We can come in, assemble the stage exactly. for you the way you, yeah. We'll have all those details ready for you. So Perfect. You know exactly what you're doing. Nice home like this is, needs a good theater to go with it. So Definitely, definitely. Yeah, I'm looking forward to making it pop for so, you, Clinton. Well, the problem with this uh, house is that it's all, the, it's initially I thought it was really cool that the staircase all open stringer yep. and it's open concept and stuff. Yep. Right, but the kids come downstairs. Yeah, and I got two kids, as you know, right? Seventeen yep. and fifteen. They want to come down. They want to watch a movie with their friends, right? Yeah. Well, guess what? Like they're like in the same room yeah. as me. So this room's yeah. really gonna allow us to enjoy the house a lot more. Kids can come down here with some friends. They can yep. make a mess in here. They can watch a movie. Shut the they door. Have their friends right? over. Yeah. And uh, this room is virtually soundproof already, which is yep. a bonus for me because yep. it's, it's mostly exterior walls. Yep. And uh, it's you know heavy brick on this wall and, and the wood solid wood door. So the room is practically soundproof already, which is great. It's it saves perfect. me ripping out all the drywall. There you go. Right. So you can make the space work <laughs> for what we're using. Exactly. So we're going to start ripping this place apart? Yeah. Okay. Always, always the best part. So I'm pretty sure you're supposed to wear a hard hat when you're demolishing a room, yes, aren't you? Yes, you are. Where, is, where, where's your hard hat? Unfortunately, it was left on another project, so... <laughs> Oh uh, well. This is really bad. Eventually safety you'll learn enough from me about safety. There you go. Okay, so hard hat in place. Jacket's coming off. All right, man. So we're going to start with uh, yanking all the, the plugs and receptacles and stuff out of the walls? Yeah. Yeah. So we'll pull this out now. Okay, cool. Battery's charged. So what do you think? Uh, got to flip a breaker or two or what? Yeah, we should make sure we kill the power. That's it's always idea, number right? one. In do you got a tester or something so we can do, see yeah. if there's... Yeah, absolutely. Obviously, we know that one was working. Your battery was charging in there, yeah. which is something. So, so we kill the breaker. We know that... Uh, make sure it's we're off. We're getting electrocuted and we start ripping this place apart. Nice. So, yeah, it's definitely got power, so we should go find the breaker. So, yeah, do you want, you want to keep that here and I'll uh, yep. go flip a few breakers and you can yell at me? Yep, sounds good. All right, let's do it. All right, what do we got? What do we got? I guess what it was an old office. It would probably be called 
office, if anything's labeled, microwave, pool shed, sauna, man. Hey, Rob! Yeah? Okay, I'm gonna start flipping some breakers off randomly here, dude. Nothing's labeled, so. You got that tester plugged in? Sure do. All right. Well, let me know if, if it uh, shuts off, all right? Yeah. Cool. Okay, how about now? No, nothing yet. Nope. Still nothing. Nope. Still nothing yet. Nope. Nope. Still nothing. Nope. Still nothing. Nope. Nope. Still nothing. Yeah, we got it. All right, cool. What the heck? Why is it so dark in here? Rob, you in there? Yeah. Unfortunately, Turn the lights on. Yeah. Well, they killed all the power in the whole room. Are you just kidding me? No. Nope. Right, I'm gonna use my iPhone light then. Coming in. See, plugs oh, yeah. are dead. Lights are dead. What the hell? So we just turned off one breaker. So yeah. what do you tell me? The the receptacles and the lights are on one breaker. Yeah. This whole room's powered by one circuit. So that's not cool. All right, dude. So what are we gonna do then? So I get to get electrician in. Yeah. We got to get this rewired. We got to. Uh, Make sure the plugs and the lights are on a separate circuit. Hmm. Well, okay, well, as far as the demo goes today, I, I get a demo the room with no light. I'll we'll have to bring in some work lights, Clinton. Do you have one in your shocker? Unfortunately, I don't think I do. Oh, man. Some hey, maybe the camera guy can lend us there this we camera go. light. Hey, can we use your, uh, your light today? Sweet. Awesome. All right, well, let's do that. Perfect. Problem solved. All right, so I've called the electrician. He's on his way. Gonna deal with these lights so that uh, you're not working in the dark. Perfect. Okay. Appreciate it. And uh, I've got my crowbar. You? I do. Hey, look, I think we should. Tool. I think any good demo should start with a, a selfie for Facebook for HT's Facebook. Yeah. What do you think? Perfect. You in? Yeah, right. I'm in. What do we got? Oh, it's blurry. Let's do it again. I think we got it. That's right. There's, there's, that's the keeper. Yeah, right All right, so we got the lights back on. Electrician came, ran a quick circuit for us, and uh, time to rip out the wall unit. Oh yeah! Too fun. I've got the wrong job. This is like what I should be doing all day long. Just ripping <laughs> things out. There's no way to be angry when you do this job. the text on there, man? I don't think so. No. Why would it say? Let's see if it's up. It's actually from Shiba. She says, I'm getting on an airplane at, uh, right now, going on vacation. Maybe we'll look a little better for a camera next time. <laughs>